Hello everyone. It's me, Infinite Designer. This is the part 10 of our series where I will teach you the entire Alight Motion app from zero to infinity. So, let's begin. Today, we are going to learn about drawing and edge effects. So this is the image that I have. So the first effect in drawing and edge is CMYK halftone dots. By this effect, you can give a dotted look to your image. You can set the amount of dots, strength of these dots, angle of the dots and also animate them by face. The next effect is called Counter Gradient. By this effect, you can add a gradient stroke on your object. You can set any two colors for a gradient. You can set the width of the stroke also. As you increase the outset, the stroke will go outside. Now if you decrease alpha then it will be affected on the stroke, but if you decrease the fill then it will be affected on your main object. Next effect is called Contour Lines. Here you can make a simple outline for your object. This effect is totally similar to the previous one. But here you'll get an extra feature of count. You can increase the number of strokes by this count feature. Next effect is Drawing Progress. For this effect, I have a simple stroked line which I have made using Vector Drawing Tool. So here you got two options, Start and End. This is the starting point of this line and this is the ending point of this line. Currently. The end value is set at 100. But if I decrease it, then it will go backward. And if I increase the start point, then the start point will go forward. So to make a drawing animation, first I have to decrease the end value to 0. Now I have to make keyframes and the eye have to set the end value at 100 at second keyframe and your drawing animation is ready.
Next effect is edge glow. By this effect, you can add glow at the edges of your object. You can adjust the smoothness of the glow. You can also change the blur and the spread of the glow. This effect is mainly used to add a glow in your text like this. Next effect is called electric edges. You can add a electric stroke to your object using this effect. You can adjust the distance, thickness, detail and many other things. You can also adjust the color of your electric lines. You can also make a cool looking animation by adjusting these options in mask section. You can also add electric lines onto your object by the counter option. Next effect is find edges. By this effect, you can achieve a pencil sketch type look into your image. Next effect is called Glow. Here you can add a simple outer glow to your object. You can adjust its radius, opacity, hardness and color also. Next effect is called Glow Scan. Here you can create a glow scanning types of effect. As you increase the threshold, 
the glow will become stronger and as you reach to one point the glow will be disappeared there are all other features similar to the normal glow effect Next effect is called half tone dots. Here you can achieve a two color dotted image effect. Here you can set any two color that you want and I can make a dotted image effect as we have made in the first effect of this video. Next effect is half tone lines. This effect is completely similar to the previous effect. The only difference is that there are dots in the previous effect and here are lines. Next effect is called inner glow. This effect is also exactly similar to the normal glow effect, but in that effect, you can add glow outside the object. Here you can add a glow inside the object. Next effect is roughen edges. Here you can make a rough edge types look onto your object. Here you can adjust the roughness by the strength, evolution and details. Next effect is called smooth bevel. Here you can add bevels to your object. It will create a 3D type look in your image. Here you can set the light point and shine of the bevel by adjusting diffuse and specular angle options. Next is smooth edges.
By this, you can round the corners of your object. Next effect is stroke color. By this effect, you can simply change the color of your stroke. Next effect is called Stroke Taper. For this effect, I have this hand drawing line here, which I have made by drawing tool. Here you got start, end and squeeze options. You can squeeze the start or end point of your stroke by this effect. So these are all the effects in drawing and edge effects of a light motion.